Lady Charmaine. You're watching Lady Charmaine Live. And I'm here with Miss Jessica Reedy from season two of Sunday Best, the girl with the beautiful spirit that encouraged all of us last year to put it all on the altar. Amen. How you doing, lady? I'm doing amazing. Now, we are here at the Stellar Award Weekend 2013. Are you one of the performers this year? I will not be performing at the Stellar Awards, but I am singing at the Pre-Stellars tomorrow. So I'm extremely excited about that. I'm, I'm so elated. I'm happy that they even want me to sing anymore for anything, so I'm grateful. So what are you going to be singing? Um, something out of nothing. Something out of nothing. So you make something out of nothing. Now, now tell me about that song and the inspiration behind that song. Um, it's pretty self-explanatory. I was absolutely nobody. Who knew me? Who cared that I existed? Who even would be bothered to say, hey, Jessica Reedy, can I take a picture? Who was that? But he saw something nobody else saw. Nobody else could could say you will be this. He saw it. And he, he molded me. He had me go through certain journeys and I made certain mistakes and I felt like those mistakes weren't wasn't factored in. And so he said, No, 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 no. I needed you to make that mistake because your reaction was gonna help you grow up. And he started making me something. So it's it's that's all the song is. It's just it's an evolution of a person, God having this, this amazing eye for talent, for potential, for, oh no, she deserves some mercy, she needs some grace, I love her, might as well make her somebody, you know. <laughs> and he made something out of nothing. Amen. This weekend, we're honoring Bishop T.D. Jakes, Inez Andrews, and Kirk Carr. So can you tell me how each one of those ministries impacted your life? Um, Bishop Jakes recently, he, uh, he says something that it's kind of sticking with me. He said, well, looks like a job for Jesus. I heard him preach. And everybody else kind of was like, oh, hallelujah, and, you know, kept going. But when he said it, well, looked like a job for Jesus. He said, go up and stressing out. <laughs> it's looking like a job for Jesus. I can't touch this. <laughs> this is all you. <laughs> so he doesn't know it. But little things that the Lord lets him say, tells him to say, it helped my whole my mentality and because my mentality changed it changes my walk and i can i can receive stuff without feeling like all right let me go ahead my whole perception is different so pastor pastor jakes has has blessed me kirk car oh my god <laughs> highness oh my god you know it's it go without words um some people presence is just impactful their ministries are just impactful and it's not enough words. It's like, what do you say? You just use one word. They amazing. Right. <laughs> amazing, especially with the passing of Inez. Especially yeah. knowing that she was being honored here at the Stellar Awards. Also too, tonight we're at the Urban Soul Cafe and we're honoring Marvin Sapp, Byron Cage, and Hezekiah Walker. And how has their music impacted you before we go? Listen. Byron Cage, new song, um, Great and Lady. Oh, my God. What do you mean? I don't know. You know what? All of them together, God, God, God makes some greats. Now, mind you, we all good. But he makes greats. Greats are the people who, who hit the brink of almost suicide, feeling like they can't make it. But they say, yeah, right. I, there's no way I'm about to give up. Like, yes, everything looks absolutely horrible, and I feel like I'm about to fall out of my mind. But there has to be more. That's a great. That's a that's a that's a person who, in a really dark place, imagines a light and walks to it. That's a great. So when you get a she preaching, y'all. You know, it's just it's amazing. It's just. Sir, I, I'm grateful you're alive, man. I just, I'm happy you here. Because it lets me know there are other greats. And maybe I'm one of them. Maybe you can train me up. Like, it's just, it's good to be in a company of greats because you can learn. Oh, God, is this what a great look like? Is this how a great sit down? Okay, let me do what the greats do. So, yeah, I love her. Don't y'all just love her? I do. I, I love me some Jessica Reedy, y'all. <laughs> so, what can we expect to see from you this year? Honesty. Um, I won't be lying anymore. Here's what lying is for me. Lying is, lying is smiling though I'm hurting and not giving you an explanation. So now I'm going to explain. Like I, I want to I wanna explain the truth behind my smile. I want to explain the truth behind my choice of walk. Why I choose to be obedient. It is hard. 
I am faced with every temptation you can imagine. But it is as if I can see God's, I can feel his. You ever feel somebody staring at you? That's how I feel about God. Everywhere I go, I feel like his eyeballs are like burning down on me. I'm like, all right, I'm not going to do nothing. Okay. So he's given me this sense and this gift of awareness to where if I make a mistake, it's because I want to. Because he, he's like, you know better. Even if you haven't read it, I'm telling you right now, you know better. So I want to I wanna show that. I want, I want everybody to know God is faithful and you actually can choose to have his walk. You might fall off a little bit, but you don't have to look like everything went down. You can smile and it will be genuine. You can smile and say, look, yeah, I messed up, but look, God, I'm so happy he ain't killed me. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the beautiful Jessica Reedy. <laughs> hey, this is Jessica Reedy, and you're watching Lady Charmaine Live.